hands down, will go down as my greatest fluff that I have ever made or ice cream. Got fruity pebbles, hot chocolate syrup, marshmallow, zero calorie, um, tons of stuff, bananas, refeed kind of, you know. You know what to call this right here. I'm just gonna call it greatness, guys. It is just so good. Welcome back, everyone. So we are currently three weeks out and this is my chest tricep and shoulder workout and you guys are going to see based off this footage and most likely anybody that usually cuts as they get closer to their goal or wherever they want to be with their cut if it's pretty low these are the movements to go so especially my bench guys it used to be my max is probably roughly around 250 right now, um, maybe a little less, maybe a little more, I'm not sure. I maxed out, I don't max out while I'm cutting, and I the last time I did max out I hit 275, but that was a while back. Now I'm just focusing on, you know, hitting like this 215 right here, and, or yeah, two, 215. Just going for about six, seven reps, um, doing as many as I can. I'm lowering my rest time on these and every other movement too. Rest time is roughly around 45 seconds to a minute just to keep my activity even higher than what I want, want it to be. And uh, yeah, so I was kind of, these this and the overhead press, man, when these were the first to go because I had strong lifts at first in these. And then... Uh, but my squat, my bench, or my squat, my deadlift have been pretty stable right now. Um, my lowest weigh-in right now is about 171 pounds. So, again, looking to be on stage at about 169. And that's where I feel comfortable at. I mean, when you guys, the cutting series season one, that's where I actually finished off last time too. So, uh, again, I think, actually, I think I was about 166, so that would be about three more pounds heavier stage weight since last time. So, what I'm really um, a big fan of while doing while cutting and making sure your intensity is increased throughout your exercises, um, making sure you're mostly hitting compounds, movements that are going to burn, you know, the most amount of calories. I've been doing a lot of barbell rows on my back days. Um bench again I've gone a little less down in the amount of times I'm doing it overhead press a good amount and uh, more front squats so training should always kind of be close to the same thing guys just sticking for more reps again a lower rest time and definitely lighter weight because of the lower rest time I can't be lifting you know what I was doing before was like 225 for six seven eight reps but now I'm just focusing on, you know, hitting like weights like 205, 215, a little lighter. And uh, yeah, as far as how, was, how have I been feeling, things have been, I've been tired a little bit. Um, again, the low carb intake about, I like to do a carb cycle within this cut. I've been doing it for about 8 to 10 weeks out. I did a carb cycle and I've stuck to it all the way through. We're looking at two low days out of the week. You guys probably think, man, I refeed a lot. Every time I do a video, it's like a refeed, a refeed, a refeed. But no, I do two a week, and I have four low days and a medium day. So that makes up my seven days. Usually I'll place my low days on Sunday, um, Monday, and it depends. Sometimes it changes up a little bit. But, uh, yeah, my... Uh, High days usually fall on Saturday, sometimes Friday, and then I'll have another day like Tuesday or Wednesday earlier in the week. So next we're moving on to triceps, an area where I think I need to improve the most, especially when I after this cut um, is going into triceps, because I think I have a strong dominant bicep, but my tricep, um, I don't know, I feel like the hardest part for me to shed the rest of my body fat is my legs and then of course the tricep so and a little bit of core but you know that's casual 
I found out my shoulders are like the number one place that comes off first, that and my bicep. But um, chest to chest gets pretty lean. So we're going to finish off this video, guys, with some overhead press. And I'm starting to do kind of burnout sets um, where I'll do at the end my heavy compound movement. And I'll go. Now, this is a weight I used to be able to do for about six, sometimes seven reps. As you guys can see, I'm at three. Um, that's number four, and I struggled. But yes, I did do this last. Um, I put this at the end of my routine, so I did bench first. So, but really, no excuse. Only got like three and a half. <laughs> so. I'm um, going to conclude the commentary, guys. Got catch this clip as a uh, last raw clip for this video. And uh, I got a few more clips after this, so make sure to watch all the way through, guys. Appreciate the support. And I'll catch you guys through the rest. don't know if you can see me right now but I'm about to make my way out of the gym and over to Panda Express yes Panda Express you heard me right on this refeed uh, high carbs today so I got about 375 in the tank I'm um, not left I've eaten out of that but uh yeah I'm gonna go to Panda Express real quick so the gym was dead. It was kind of nice. I'm going to turn off my blinker real quick because I'm turning and I'm talking to you guys. I don't want to. Um, but yeah, it's about 9.22 right now. I've been eating super late. I have a test to take online for my class. These cars are kind of, you know, making over my noise of me talking. But yeah, I got a test I got to redo because I was falling asleep during it last night. Just being honest. Just about to place my order, just got here at Panda Express, and uh, I'm hungry. So I've been wanting to do this for a while, but I haven't had Panda Express, so. Panda while listening to Panda. Too far away from the window. Man, it's crazy. Huh? So bad. Oh, see. Hi, can I get a plate? Okay. Uh, can I get a plate with white rice? Okay. And broccoli beef. And the string bean chicken. White rice, broccoli, and string bean? Yep. And that'll be it. Alright, that'll be out the window. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. She's talking to me. It's on the radio too. I hope I don't hit this wall. Oh, uh, no, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, you too. Guys, I'm not a big fan of this song. It's not bad, but it's like weird. That toothbrush? Um, 
So right now I got my Panda Express. I'm about to head home. Go home and enjoy this. It's good food. And uh, gonna go home, enjoy this food, guys. Relax. So I know the cutting series isn't over, the season three. Um, but future series, what should we do next? Should we do In, per in Pursuit of Love? A series where I... <laughs> Just kidding. A series where I'm out looking for love. This has been a while. And I kind of, honestly right now in my life, I kind of feel like it'd be selfish though if I did, you know, start looking, you know, for someone. I'm not ready. I still am trying to focus on my own self as far as business, school, and uh, that's some of my main things that I'm focusing on. If I tried to even give a little bit of my time, it would not work. That's why a main reason why I don't talk to any like a girl right now is because I'd be too selfish to do it, and you know I'd, I'm waiting. Plus, I would need them to be like working out all the time with me, all that. And that's a lot to ask. I wouldn't be able to spend time with them. So. I think they gave me double broccoli. Alright, time to see what our fortune cookie says. I'm not going to eat the cookie. Wow. There we go. I'm not going to eat that. Approach all areas of life with bold, a bold enthusiasm. Not bad. I'll take it. Alright, so it's 5.18 right now. I'm about to eat some. This is my second meal. Spinach, um, tomatoes, sweet potato, then we got mushrooms, broccoli, chicken and eggs with pork rinds in here, a little bit of chili sauce, and then we're having protein fluff here. So we got protein fluff, peanuts, blueberries, cinnamon, walnut farm caramel, two Korean cakes, this orange um, packet drink. So. Alright guys, so right now it is 8.45 going on 9 o'clock. I have to eat my last bit of calories on this 2200 calorie day. I'm feeling tired. Might have like a um, cup, a little small cup of coffee before. Because I got homework to do, I got videos to upload. And uh, let's see how many calories we have actually left for today. Um, so we got 1101. Only 1,100 today. So, again, the macros today, 220 protein, 165 carb, 73 grams of fat. So, let's feast, because I'm tired and uh, I need some food. Here's a piece of our dinner, guys. It's a lot of spinach, mushroom, chicken. Uh, I got a little bit of cauliflower, or yeah, cauliflower broken down into like rice form, blended it. So I'm gonna add tuna into this and an egg two easy eggs. So just got done, I added my hickory smoked tuna into it. I'm also going to be adding a little bit of barbecue, well not barbecue sauce, a chili sauce for this. And uh, the eggs are pretty much done. Two over easy eggs. Came out pretty good too, I usually not good. So add that on top. That's how it came out guys. I'm going to add that chili sauce. Okay. So this chili sauce right here, H-E-B chili sauce, is so good. I'm about to add it onto here with a little bit of sriracha. Now I'm gonna make some homemade ice cream because it has it's I need a lot of protein and it's very high protein because I use whey protein for the ice cream. So I'm gonna make that. And fun little fact, if there's one thing I'm not gonna miss as much um, after this cut is cooking. I would hire a personal chef if I had the money. Crazy how much you cook. <laughs> 